happy Friday, y'all. It's about 9.30. I'm sitting outside of Publix. I need to run in. I need, that piece of hair right there is throwing me off. I need cat food. I need waters. Did I already say it's 9.30 in the morning? I went to the gym. I got me a little coffee. I just left the bank, so now let's go into Publix. I also want to go to Sephora. I'm on the hunt for like a good vacation type perfume. There's actually one called Vacation. I went to Ulta recently, smelled every cologne, every perfume, did not love any of them. I also couldn't find the vacation one that I'm looking for at Ulta, so I figured that we could go to Sephora together. Also, tonight is the rodeo. I mentioned it in my Bloom Chic haul. I'll link that video down below. I'm going to the rodeo with my friend Melinda. Her husband and Brian is also going. So many people had great suggestions for wearing pants because of all the dirt and the dust. It is inside. So hopefully it won't be super hot, but it's still probably gonna be dirty. I did grab me a pair of black flares from Target recently. So I'll probably wear those tonight, but we'll get dressed tonight together. We'll get ready with me, we'll go to the rodeo, but first let's go into Publix. We're at a different Publix today in a different part of town. This is the one we actually used to go to all the time until they built that other one that y'all usually see in my videos. It smells so good in this store. They must be making fresh bread or something in the bakery. All right, cat food. Usually y'all know we buy the box but I've been buying the individuals and I think that she likes that a little bit better. There we go, we got eight. Next stop is those lemon waters I like, but we're passing the Diet Coke. We do need Diet Coke. They have buy two, get one free. So I guess we'll grab some while we're here. I can't get anything cold because I'm not going straight home. I thought about getting Brian, oh my gosh, should I pass the waters? I did. I thought about getting Brian that um, tea that he likes, but it's cold. Here we go, lemon water. I think four will be enough. Publix, check. Let's go to Sephora. Y'all already know our Sephora, the only one we have, is inside of Kohl's. I'm distracted. Look how pretty this color is. Lauren Conrad brand. I love this. Okay, could be cute for tonight. These two may not even work, but I liked this. It's a romper. It's like that gauzy material. And then I thought this white one, it looks very short, but it was cute. Don't mind the sports bra and the socks. I also just left my bike shorts on. This is cute. I love this color, stretchy straps. I like the little tie, the smocking. It has pockets you could probably wear, I would assume a regular bra with it because these straps are thick. I love this color. Okay, I kind of like this. See, this is what happens when I came for perfume. All right, this is cute. Could be casual, dress it up a little bit as well. I really thought I would like this one more. Love Fire, I think is the brand. In a size extra, extra large. Again, I have my shorts on. I think it's a little bit too small, but I liked the idea of it. It's just, it's cute, it's not for me. This one is a complete fail. It is so short. Like the size is fine, it's just such a short. It's, it's short, okay. It looks like a shirt. I could probably cut it there and wear it as a shirt. This is a fail. I put all the dresses back, romper dresses, whatever you want to call them. Let's see if they have what we want in here. I'm pretty sure it's called vacation. Do y'all know what I'm talking about? I should have Googled it. I'll put a picture here. I'll Google it and insert a picture here for you. But it's a women's fragrance and it's called vacation. I sprayed a few of these for Brian and I just have them sitting, this one and this one, just letting them gather their scents before I smell them. This is Burberry Hero. Mm, I think that's too sweet. Armani Code. Ooh. Okay, I like that one. Eternity for men. This green one right here. Mm, mm -mm. One million from this one. That bottle is super cool. That's how I am with Estee That's my I've narrowed it down to two. This one, Earthy Greens and Herbs, Ralph's club and this one is calvin klein defy cool spices i do really like this one too but i think it's a little bit too citrusy for him i did get a few things so let's talk about it i topped up on my hand sanitizer this purple one incredible this is the scent pure lavender this is probably my favorite but they didn't have it in store so we got watermelon people ask me all the time too where i get these sephora ulta target sometimes will have them these are my favorite 
hand sanitizer. I like that they're slim for the purse. I got my birthday gift, the Kosas. This is what I picked. It's an air brow, oh, an air brow clear lifting treatment gel with lamination effect. I'm very excited for that. Wet lip oil gloss. It doesn't say the shade on here, but it's probably that shade. I did order the Il Maquillage Brow Serum, which should arrive any day now. So between that and this, I feel like that laminated brow look is going to be easy to achieve. I also grabbed the Way Thick Hair Mask. I like the Way Thick Hair Shampoo and Conditioner. I also like the Way Detox Shampoo. And I'm pretty sure I've tried the mask before, but I'm in the market for a mask. So I purchased this. Ooh. Let me just slide that back. I wanted to smell it. I guess I got to, huh? It does smell very good. All right, for me, I ended up getting this. Ellis Brooklyn Sun, a fragrance body mint. Oh, I thought I wasn't recording. This was like 30 bucks compared to a perfume. You know, it's like 100, 150 bucks nowadays. And this is not the vacation scent, though I've never smelled the vacation scent. I just wanted something beachy, and this definitely is. They also had one that was like peaches, like a more citrus, florally citrus. Whereas this one definitely is beach scented. I grabbed Brian Armani Code from Giorgio Armani. This was the smaller version. It was still expensive. I liked this one the best. He will wear whatever I like, but I've known him for so long at this point that he's had like a long list of different colognes and different scents. And I think I like this kind of light, slight, like woodsy citrus if that makes sense, go smell it. If you have a Sephora Ulta perfume store, cologne store near you, I think I like that versus spicy is the word I'm looking for. Okay, that took me way too long to say and I'm gonna cut all that out so that you don't watch me struggle. But I like more woodsy versus spicy, okay? That's what I got. I'm so excited for this though. I've been wearing Clinique Happy, but I've had it for years. And then I also wear, it's like a Versace travel one that I've been using a lot lately too. It is now almost 11 o'clock. I got no clothes, but we know why. <laughs> we all watch me try them on. Uh, what else do I need to do? I need to call my mom. It is that time. And then I guess I'll see y'all later. I'm gonna go home, take a shower. I wanna put a little fake tan on. I should, probably should have gotten that three hour express one by, is it Saint Tropez? I need to see if I have one at home that I can use, but okay, that's it. There's my mini haul, I'll see you later. Welcome back, it is 4.30, I got distracted. I was gonna get ready with you, but also we've been getting ready together a lot lately, but I wanted to try this with you, this Kosas. We got it as my birthday gift today from Sephora. I did try it, I don't love it, but that's okay, that's okay. I curled my hair with this versus the smaller barrel one because I just wanted big curls. I don't know for sure of an outfit yet. I did do a little fashion show with Brian, um, but we need to leave here in 30 minutes. That is the plan. We're going to Robertsdale, Robertsdale, Alabama. So it's probably, it's five o'clock traffic on a Friday across the bay. So I think we need to be there between 6.30 and seven. So we're gonna try to leave around five. I haven't brushed my hair yet. Should we? Let's brush it. I just like finger combed it with, some of this Kerastase hair oil. I might wear a hat. Also, I might not wear the black jeans. Let's top it up with a little bit of hairspray. This is the Kenra Volume Spray 25. Oh, it's leaking. There we go. Let's put an outfit together and I'll see you when we're ready. Brian is taking a nap. He went golfing today. Uh, so he's been napping on the couch, but I know I keep hearing the dryer beep. So that means that he has put a couple of options in the dryer. So let's see what he's wearing. I think this is the outfit I'm gonna go with. This top I got a while ago from Old Navy, just a little lacy bralette underneath it. These are those Sophia pull-on Walmart jeans. They're so comfortable with cowboy boots. We're going with the white little cowboy boots. Y'all have seen these a million times. I put on double gold hoops. Yeah, I like this. I'll have to show y'all Brian's outfit. We're getting close. I think we're going the right way. It's in our GPS, which I need to look at, but I'm vlogging on my phone, but look how pretty it is outside. And then I'll show you Brian's proper outfit at the rodeo. We made it. We made it. Uh, traffic was not terrible at all, nope. um, but we did give, us, give ourselves plenty of time. 
this, I think, uh, what Melinda was telling me that it's an, a, like adult rodeo. Cause we thought it was a youth rodeo. It's adults, but it benefits the youth rodeo. I think that's what she said. We need to purchase ticket. Not yet. Not yet. Okay. You gotta get in. This one. Get All right. Okay. Thank you. Tickets are 18 bucks. Oh, good thing I brought cash. First stop is the little section where they sell things. Oh, let me show you Brian's outfit while he walks. He was worried not everybody was gonna be wearing a cowboy hat. Actually, he didn't really care. He was gonna wear his anyways. There's his outfit. Here's the arena. We're a little bit early, so it hasn't quite started yet. We're gonna get a good seat. Seems like everybody's sitting on that side on the right. I guess maybe it is not in the sun. Maybe that one was in the sun earlier or something. Yeah. We picked these seats kind of in the middle. And it's, we're just waiting for it to start. Everyone meet Melinda. Hi. This is who I talked about in my video. Look at her cute outfit. It's her first time at the rodeo as well. <laughs> yes. Where are you from? I'm from, originally from Connecticut, but I live in Spanish Florida, Alabama. Yeah, this is not our first time meeting. <laughs> Melinda talked me into coming to the rodeo. I did. And I'm from here and I've never been to the rodeo. So I'll get some out, uh, video of our cute outfits eventually. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, Rodeo check. We didn't show you our outfits. I'll put in some pictures that we took of our outfits. Are you sweaty? I'm a little bit sweaty. What do you think about the rodeo? Oh my gosh, it's way more intense than I had expected. It's the fun though. So awesome. so it's fun. fun though. So fun, so awesome. We'll do it again. Yes. We're gonna do, and we're, we're gonna, gonna look for more. We're too. gonna do uh, line dancing. Yes. That's our next yeah. outing and trip. <laughs> yes. We'll take the vlog. Yes. <laughs> That'll be fun. It'll be really hilarious to see yeah. that. <laughs> and then there were two. Just me and Brian. Did you have a good time? I did. I did. <laughs> the bleachers aren't super comfy, but it wasn't terrible. Oh my goodness. Hey yo, boo -boo. Hi my sweet girls. Where's that kitty kitty? Where's your sissy? Hi. Go outside? It's so nice out here. We gotta fix the lights on the cabana back there okay good night y'all i'll see you tomorrow i found layla what are you doing she's debating if she wants to get in the bed with me or not it's like midnight happy sunday y'all i'm actually headed to see the new deadpool movie with one of my nieces but i thought that we could end this video and do a little rodeo recap but let me get out of this parking lot first all right we had so much fun i i don't know if i told you i'm pretty sure that i did i've never been to anything like that before when we say rodeo at least like in my family like circle of people we think of like the fish and rodeo so that was the first time that i've ever done anything like that i have ridden horses before like i've been to farms i've done farm things i've camped like i've done all the things but I've just never been to a rodeo and it was so much fun it was set up as a benefit for the youth rodeo I'm pretty sure so they weren't serving alcohol but they were serving food like concession type hot dogs nachos German sausages drinks like things like that so we didn't try the food but next time maybe we will. I think they were doing it again last night. It was like a three night event. I'm very happy with my outfit choice. The jeans were super comfortable. The top was flowy enough and not thick. It was hot, but it wasn't, like I wasn't sweating. I was more like sticky versus sweating. We actually got in under those big fans. So it really wasn't that bad. It was just warm. I bought a bottled water. That took me seven times to say. Not really seven, but three, but you're only seeing me say it one time that was correct. I bought a bottled water. We will do line dancing next. There's a place in Fairhope called some kind of saloon. It may just be the saloon, but they, oh, we've talked about it before. They do line dancing where they teach you at a certain time. And then after that, when the bar opens, you can stay and like do the line dancing. So we definitely want to do that. We will take y'all with us to do that, but it was fun. I hope that y'all enjoyed it. I'll try to find everything I can 
outfit wise and link it down below though I've talked about those jeans so much and it's been a while so maybe they're back in stock but they've been sold out for the longest time and then that top from Old Navy I got it's been a long time I'm pretty sure it was in a video but it was from the sales section like I shopped in store and got it so I will do my very best to find those things and link them down below for you. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. The next vlog you get next week, I think will be my official like pack with me because we'll be out of town. So that should be fun, like a prep and pack with me for a beach vacation. I don't have anything else to say. I hope you liked it. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.